This is the first movie of the Ray Tracer running on the new hardware, which I have acquired. To wit, the best workstation I could get now, which is a Haswell 8-core 5960X chip. Um, and it in fact runs the render full screen at 30 frames a second pretty nicely. And um, I'm just showing off a few things which I could do before but not this fast in full screen. And so here we have a little a sphere made up of little spherelets which are themselves made out of cubes. And we see a much bigger copy of that in the distance. which has a little copy of itself inside itself. And we see there's some translucent mist. Now, this interference pattern is coming from a pattern with a mirror. The interference is between, is between the pattern and the rays. And I just flatten the camera somewhat Now we're falling past the mirror, coming way, and we're still zoomed in. Again, it's chalking along at 30 frames a second, full screen, pretty nicely. Cubes of cloud. There's tons of stuff in here that you could never do on a GPU. GPUs are dinosaurs. CPUs are mammals. They existed before the GPU existed. And they will exist after the GPU is obsolete and no longer used for graphics. I don't deny that it will be useful for some things. That kind of parallelism. But not for real-time graphics. Here we're dropping through the stained glass hell.